Adolf P. Lahr resided in this home at 503 Southeast 1st Street. A.P. Lahr was one of Evansville's prominent entrepreneurs in the late 19th and early 20th centuries. Lahr was born on June 17, 1849, in Germany. As a young boy, he worked in his uncle's dry goods store, triggering his interest in the business. Upon his arrival in America around 1867, he worked as a clerk in the Frank Hopkins dry goods store in Evansville. Six years later, he opened his own dry goods store in Iowa. He returned to Evansville after only two years, got married, and became manager of Miller Brothers Dry Goods. Again, he moved away to Carmi, Illinois to open his own store. Laura and his wife stayed there for nearly four years before once again returning to Evansville and opening a store on Fulton Avenue in what was then called Lamasco. In 1888, he expanded his business, buying the Hopkins store where he had once worked. He renamed it the Lar Hopkins Store. In 1898, the Lar Hopkins Store consolidated with the H.E. Bacon Company, opening a new store called the Lar Bacon Department Store. This store was extremely successful and was every child's favorite store at Christmas time. Lar remained involved in the Lar Bacon Store before selling his interest and focusing on his dry goods business, and worked until the weeks leading up until his death on May 21, 1933. The house itself was built in 1890 in the Queen Anne style, designed by architects Harris and Shopbell. Notable features of the architecture are the classic porch, which wraps around the side of the house and contains ionic columns. There's a round arch window underneath the centered gabled dormer. The house also features limestone lintels. Although its appearance has changed over the years, this home continues to draw the attention of visitors to the historic Riverside District.